Hello everyone, Conch Interest Reef here, and in today's video I would just like to talk about some great nano fish for a reef tank. So yeah, let's get into it. Oh, he's actually out right now. Let's look. Starting off, we have a firefish. Um, very, very timid fish, but they are very hardy. And I've actually kept a group of three of them, but um, this one died and they started killing each other. So I would usually recommend either odd number or one. But yeah, very pretty fish, easy to keep, cheap, commonly available. So yeah, that's one of my first ones on the list. My second one includes two types of clownfish. I got the uh, the Percula clownfish, very, very beautiful little fish. And I have uh, a little baby Ocellaris clownfish, and they're both um, peaceful. I know some clownfish can be kind of nasty. I've had a clownfish in the past who is quite mean, but most clownfish are pretty uh, timid. They're not very aggressive, but they're always out, so they're great fish. They're never hiding. thing with that dart fish, he's always, that firefish, he's always hiding, so having some fish that are always out, so you can always come to the tank and see some fish is pretty nice. But yeah, those ocellaris and percula clownfish are very nice, good, good choices for a, a small reef tank. Here's another good one that is, it has a big drawback, but they're very beautiful, a dotty back. I think this is a, uh, I forget the name of it, I'll pop it up on screen right now, somehow, I'm just having a brain fart, but um, they're they're hardy, peaceful, the only thing is these dotty backs are a bit aggressive, so you just have to watch out for that. I added them on last, I'm only, this is my frag system, it's pretty young. Uh, I added the little clownfish first, and I added the dotty back second. Uh, so you genuinely, you generally want to add them last to your system. You know, usually I the uh, the more aggressive fish last. So they have the potential to be a bit nasty, but um, this one's been pretty good so far. But um, there's some more fish, but we have to jump over to my uh, dad system to look at them. All right, see you guys there. All right, guys, hopping over to my dad system. Uh, another great nano fish is the Royal Grama. Very beautiful. Got that bicolor, the purple and the yellow. Very pretty fish. Pretty timid. Um, never had any aggression issues. Uh, and pretty hardy. They'll pretty much eat anything. That goes with anything. All these fish are very easy to feed. They're kind of weird. They'll sit upside down in caves. Pretty hard to see them right now. But another fish, I don't see them at the moment, but it is a six line wrasse. Six and wrasse are very hardy, very easy to keep. Um, they're a bit aggressive, similar to the dotty back. They're more mean and aggressive. So he was added last to the system, and plus he was very small. So it helps having a very small specimen. Uh, especially all the other fish are bigger than him, so he won't be as mean. But they'll eat, they'll regularly, t regularly take uh, any prepared food and things like that. So yeah, those are some of the uh better nano fish to keep uh obviously some of them like the dotty back in the six line need to be added last for aggression management but the rest like the clownfish can be added first and the royal grama and the firefish so yeah um i hope this got this helped you out this video uh if it did please make sure to like and subscribe we really appreciate it, it really helps the channel and yeah see you guys later bye